So we're here today talking to Andrew at uh, Friendly Farms, yeah? Yep. So one of the cool things that I um, learned from you yesterday was your hypothesis on recycling hash water or using new uh, water for every time you wash a batch. So my question is, what is your thoughts on that? Why do you believe that or why do you think that way and can you just describe to us like what's your like your favorite SOP as far as water is concerned like do you use RO water do you use tap water do you filter what do you do and then do you reuse it or why or why not and just your thoughts on the whole water usage in the process yeah so um for recirculating your water is um kind of a hot topic of debate in hash making um there's sort of two camps of thought. One is that you should uh, always use fresh water. Um, and the other is that recirculating water is uh, a more efficient process. I'm actually more inclined to recirculating water um, and not just for the usual um, reduction in ice consumption and uh, water conservation, but from a chemical standpoint, whenever you um, introduce water to cannabis in an ice water extraction, water is going to have a lot less salts, minerals, uh, vitamins that is present in the cannabis, but the water being clean and fresh doesn't have. So through osmosis, the water will actually force its way into the plant cells um, and it's called a hypertonic solution. So what happens is the plant cells will start swelling up over time, especially as the water and wash proceeds and the temperatures get warmer. What will happen is the plant cells will actually swell up to the point that they'll start to pop and rupture. And when that cell wall is broken, that's when a chlorophyll can leach out of the plant cells and get into your not only your hash water, but your hash. Because chlorophyll is generally around the 20 to 25 micron range. So if you're collecting a 25 bag, you'll actually see more and more chlorophyll contamination as it leaks out through the wash. So the reason I like recirculating water is after that first wash, a lot of uh, salts, minerals, vitamins um, that are inside the cannabis cells will leach out. And it's kind of making a tea. It also will slightly adjust the pH um, due to all the uh, organic acids, proteins that are also present in organic matter. And um, basically the reason I like recirculating this is as the water starts to match more and more the composition of the fluid inside the cannabis, it'll try to enter the plant cells with less and less force um, which should reduce the amount of uh, cells popping open due to the um, excessive uh, water content. Versus if you add fresh water every time, you're effectively not only stripping everything out of the plant like uh, minerals and salts, but you're in effect actually adding more water into the plant cells with osmosis. By recirculating your water, you should be able to reduce the amount of chlorophyll leaching that you're observing and on top of conserving more water and needing less ice in your wash. So with that in mind, um, I tend to lean towards recirculating my water.